welcome to today's workout. I'm gonna give you five moves that are gonna help you get a flatter stomach. These are the best moves that you need to really help you sculpt your tummy area. So if you're ready, let's get those abs. So these are the five moves that are the best things to flatten your stomach. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do 40 seconds of exercise and then we're gonna do a 20 second rest. But in that 20 second rest, I'm gonna give you the best tips to be able to get the results fastest as you can. So the first exercise, we're gonna come all the way down to the ground. We're gonna tuck those hips underneath, lift those legs up. We're gonna take it into single leg drops. So first of all, pull the belly button into towards the spine, tuck those hips underneath, release your hands onto the ground, no tension in your neck or your shoulders. I'm gonna take it very slowly into a single leg drop. You're gonna Take it down as low to the ground as you can. Now, if you start to feel your back coming off the ground, it is so important that you just come down to halfway. It doesn't matter if you can get your legs all the way down to the ground because we're working on our abs today, right? So you are not gonna work those ab exercises. You're not gonna work those ab muscles if you're not doing it all correctly. So I'm gonna give you the best tips that people do not tell you about how to get abs. So tuck that belly button in towards your spine and then tuck those hips underneath and relax that head and take it all the way down to your edge as much as you can and here we go you got this everybody and I'm gonna motivate you so that you finish this quick five minute blast all right good job everyone we're gonna take into our next exercise I'm gonna give you a modification for this one so bringing your hands down here you're gonna take it into in and out so you're gonna work the top part of your ab here as well so if you want to take it into a little bit more of a challenging version you're gonna extend those legs out and bring those arms up out to the side three two one let's go Okay, so you might feel that you feel it a little bit in the quads as well. So if you do feel it more in the quads, lean back a little bit further and then release your hands onto the ground. Lift that chest up nice and high, bring those shoulders away from the ears and give yourself a smile because guess what? You decided to show up today and this is how you get results is by keep on showing up. Consistency is key. That's it, you've got this. Now extend those legs a little bit further. Can you lean back just a little bit more? Push yourself to your edge. Come on, we have just got another 10 seconds here. What are you made of? Here we go, and let's go for three, two, one, and release. Okay, we're gonna lie all the way down. We're gonna work a little bit of those obliques. So this, I'm really getting you all of the ways that you can flatten your stomach from the top abs to the lower abs, those obliques and the middle of the We're gonna do bicycles. So bring your hands behind your head and we're gonna take it across the body and lift up. Now, the little tip here is to bring your elbow to your knee when your knee is at a right angle, not your knee towards your elbow. So this is what most people do, is they bring their knee all the way here. We're gonna bring our knee just to 90 degrees and we're gonna lift up that chest. Oh yeah, so you'll feel it even more in the top part of your abs and those oblique muscles. Keep those elbows nice and wide and think about lifting your chest using the top part of your abs. Most people, when they do bicycles, they bring it so close towards their chest and we wanna bring the chest up towards our knee. All right, you've got this. Keep on going, everybody. Inhale through your nose, exhale out, and give yourself a nice little smile for three, two, one, and release down. Oh my goodness, I told you, when you do things properly, you don't have to do abs for hours and hours a day. You just do it correctly. So now we're gonna lift those legs up to the sky and we're gonna reach up. So again, we're working the full part of the abs right here. Now, if you need to, you can take a slight bend in the knee and just lift up through the chest. If your neck is hurting, just take your head into your hands and lift up through the chest. Now, do not do this. This is what people do, is they bring those elbows in. I want you to take those elbows out to the side and then think about using those ab muscles to lift up through your chest. Here we go, inhale through your nose and exhale everything out. Come on now, straighten those legs just a little bit more for me and let's now hold up at the top. Now bring those elbows out more. Now lift up a little bit higher. Come on, you've got this. Take a nice big inhale and take it into a couple more pulses. Yes, lift that chest up. Point those toes for me. Keep on pushing forward. You've got this. Why did you show up today to get results and release? Okay, see, I told you, you do these properly, you're gonna get incredible results. We're gonna take it into a nice starfish right here. So again, we're gonna work on the lower abs and those oblique muscles. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna tap and you're gonna come all the way down and lift. Now, if you wanna make this a bit more challenging, you can bring your head into your hands and then keep your chest lifted the whole time. And if you wanna make it even more challenging, you can lift and keep one leg up. 
Oh yes, yeah. so that's why in these workouts, we have modifications for absolutely everybody. So if you go to a workout and you're like, I don't have weights, I don't have resistance bands, it doesn't matter, okay? You don't have to do the exercises with weights. All you've got to do is keep on showing up on this channel and getting those results that you deserve. Okay, here we go. Lift up a little bit more. Come on, now squeeze. Now maybe let's give it a go, bringing both legs up off the ground. Oh yes, this is a killer exercise. It is not easy, so bring those elbows out to the side give yourself a smile give me one more and release okay gently roll all the way up you guys crushed it and you're already on your mat so why don't you check out this full ab workout that's really going to help you get results and you know that i talk about this all the time 20 percent is fitness 80 percent is nutrition so if you want to get started with a great nutrition plan you get a one-on-one -on -one coach then join my app it's absolutely amazing it's going to get you great results and you become a vip see you guys on the next workout bye thin and exhale come all the way back to the center lift that chest up even more really stretch up as much as you can bring those feet together come all the way down to the ground and release that head 